the working principle and the technical specifications of the active harmonic filter. Active harmonic filter is a device used to dynamically filter out the harmonic currents in the power system. Its working principle can be divided into two following steps. First step is that the AHF utilizes current transformers to measure the load currents in the grid in real time. The digital signal processor analyzes the measured current signals using Fourier transform algorithm to extract the amplitude of each harmonic components. It calculates the compensation current needed to be injected into the grid. The phase and the amplitude of the compensation current are opposite to the detected harmonic current, thus achieving the purpose of cancelling out the harmonic. This process involves various control algorithms to ensure the accuracy and the real-time nature of the compensation current. Then, the AHF utilizes insulated gate bipolar transistors to inject the calculated compensation current into the grid. The compensation current is typically injected in parallel between the load and the power source, directly counteracting the harmonic components in the grid. Finally, AHF continuously monitors the grid currents and the compensation effect, adjusting the compensation strategy in real time to cope with the load variations and the harmonic fluctuations, ensuring the optimum harmonic elimination effect. Here, I have written a python program that allows you to view the harmonic waveforms, extract harmonic waveforms and spectra and display the current waveforms output from the active harmonic filter. You will find that the output waveform is identical in magnitude to the harmonic waveform but opposite in phase. According to this working principle, AHF have several technical indicators. Rated capacity is the maximum harmonic current that AHF compensate which is expressed in amperes. Harmonic compensation range is the range of harmonic frequencies that AHF can compensate for. The total harmonic distortion. The total harmonic distortion rate of the current after compensation which should typically be lower than a specific standard. The dynamic response speed. The speed at which the AHF responds to the load changes usually measured in milliseconds. Faster response time indicates better dynamic compensation. The power factor range. The range of a power factor that AHF can adjust to ensuring the system operates at a high power factor state to improve the energy utilization efficiency. This means that all AHF have power factor correction functionality. System efficiency, it is the energy conversion efficiency of AHF during operation, usually expressed as a percentage. Efficient AHFs can minimize their own energy consumption. The voltage level and frequency range. AHF is usually connected in parallel in the grid system. So, it is necessary to consider the voltage level of the grid such as 400 volt, 690 volt, etc. and the applicable grid frequency. Active harmonic filters effectively eliminate harmonic issues in power systems by detecting, calculating and injecting compensating currents in real time, thereby improving the power quality. Their fast, dynamic response and superior filtering performance make them widely used in modern power systems. Selecting the appropriate AHF requires comprehensive considerations of its technical indicators to ensure it meets the specific requirements of the application scenario.